it's not a walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like. Okay then, this is, um, no, first of all, my apologies for torturing you with such a god-awful game, but uh, time is out of control, really. I, life is getting complicated and, and things are happening and I'm not getting time to do decent videos, so I'm just cramming this in because it's quick and easy. This is called Moto Kid on the uh, TV Boy 2. It's otherwise known as Megaforce by 20th Century Fox on the Atari 2600. If you suffer from any kind of photo-sensitive epilepsy, stop watching now because I, I don't want to be responsible for you being in hospital or something because this might push people over the edge. It's really hard on the eyes. Here we go. I hope you stop watching if you have any medical conditions that... stuff. Right. So, uh... It's... There are elements of Defender in this. Phew, I hadn't noticed that before. I don't know if it will come into play at any point. There are elements of scramble and defender and stuff here. I fly along. If I'm above the horizon, I fire horizontally. If I go below, I'm kind of firing diagonally down, like bombing instead of missiles and stuff. Ooh, and there are aliens that I can kill and frequently get killed by. Ah, get off me, you... alien scumbag thing. They're a lot easier to kill with the horizontal fire than the diagonal. And they seem to just... Yeah, it's like he's, he's firing a clone of himself at me. There. Or, or they just respawn the moment they fire. I don't know, it's all weird. Oh, and you can crash apparently. Don't go down. I didn't know that. That's odd. Oops. Yeah, don't fly into them either. It looks like some kind of hover bike, I think. That those aren't wheels going round there. Yeah. It's like some kind of Harrier-esque thing. But a motorbike. Well, it's like a jet ski that flies. That'd be cool. Come here. Oh, he's gone. Right, fine, I don't care. Oh, oh. Um, maybe don't blow up the... Fuel silos? I don't know. We'll try that again. What happens if you hit the... Are you meant to hit the fuel silos? I don't know. Probably not. I wouldn't have thought so. Alert. I'm very alert, thank you. It seems if you get, if you push them off the screen, they, they just go away. That's not all. I don't know if I'm meant to be blow... Oh, alright. You blow up... That F is my fuel level, whoops, that is constantly going down. So, fuel at 37. Let's go to a fuel silo and see. Yeah, right, you bomb the fuel silos and your fuel level goes up, like in Scramble, because that makes sense, doesn't it? Your fuel tank's empty, go to a fuel silo, blow it up. Uh-huh. Games were like that back in the day. This is actually, it's, it's, I mean, it's so... It's wrong on so many levels, but it's actually quite fun to play. I think I would have liked this had I had it on my Atari back in 1980-something. Oh, dear. Yeah. Now they've all gone away. I wonder if it's possible to win. Can you win this game? What? Uh, what's that? I don't know what that was, but it died when I shot it. Oh. Oh. There's an amount of inertia. Well, bugger me. It didn't die. I'm pretty damn sure I hit it. It seems that, uh, yeah, when they're in the air, your bombs don't seem to hit them. Your bombs only seem to take out the fuel silos. That's pretty limiting. 
Okay, what's going on here? They seem to have a limited range as well. I'll, I'll just, yeah, I'm not firing at it. It's blowing up. That's fairly stupid, really. I don't get it. Am I getting an? Oh. Okay. Okay. That's the end of the game. Uh, I seem to have a score of 500 already, having done nothing whatsoever. I like games that give you points for doing nothing. I forgot what the game's called now. <laughs> Here we go. Moto Kid, because it looks like you're on a motorbike. A flying one, but it's Mega Force. On the Atari 2600. Well, I'm playing it on the TV Boy 2. It's, there are many, many, many things that are wrong with it. But given the hardware that it's playing on, I find that quite entertaining in a limited kind of way. Okay, apologies for giving you such a god-awful game to watch. And any of you who are riding around on the floor, sorry about that. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider clicking the thumbs up button. I upload videos daily, so go ahead and hit subscribe if you'd like to see more. To all those who've already subscribed, I'd just like to say a great big thank you.